Hey, good evening, everybody, and welcome to this weekly Zoom event. My name is Adam Levy. I'm here in Chester, Connecticut. You're at Tuesday Night Live. We do it every Tuesday night, 8 p.m. Eastern Time. Glad you could join us tonight. Uh, we've got a couple of quick topics we're going to cover, some announcements, some things that are going on that you don't want to miss. Uh, but I do want to hear from Bill Mullen, get a little update. Bill has had some great results uh, with some of our products. Bill, how are you this evening? Hey, young man, doing doing good. How what's going on over there? Uh, we're just having a you know a time of our life here. It's it's just such an exciting time with Glutamis. So many incredible things are happening. People are coming on board. Uh, really great leadership. Uh, but I know you're getting such great results with the products. Can you tell everybody your story and, and kind of give us an update? Sure. I, Cowboy introduced this to me a, a, a while ago, and I'm now getting active and going with it. But um, when the mist came out, the xylem mist is the one that I'm focused on because it affects my uh, CML or chronic myeloid leukemia uh, the best. And again, I've shared uh, the ingredients and everything with both my oncologist and my internist, and they are like, do not stop taking this. And uh, my numbers, my white blood cell counts uh, at the spike were right around 90,000 uh, plus mutation. So uh, leukemia is no fun. That's, uh, we'll share it. We'll stop it at that. But my numbers are down into the low 40,000s now. And I actually feel like I want to do things. And I think that's the, the biggest hint I can say about the product. Not that it's going to cure what I have because it, it can't, it won't. But uh, it definitely makes a difference on how I feel and act. And you're talking about the Xanthomist that you've been on. And how long have you been on the Xanthomist? Cowboy, what, almost three months now, three and a half months? Incredible results in a short period of time. Now, Bill, uh, congratulations on that. And again, that's a, a serious issue that you're dealing with. And to get any kind of, uh, you know, relief is has got to be amazing for you. Um, it definitely makes me feel the difference, no doubt. That's awesome. Have you added, uh, I, I heard you mention the CBD a coffee you just got have you also added the glutamist recently or is that something you're planning on the, doing in the future the glutamist is in the future for me meaning a short time away a week or two weeks but uh coffee for sure i i had uh my first couple cups this morning and felt amazing so i was like okay this is good <laughs> but uh, i take the vitamins and i take the chewy and uh yeah, I, I definitely feel better about it. And, you know, I want to welcome, I don't know if, if you can tell me if Jesus is on this call, hmm. but. Uh, well, you know what? I don't know that he's here, but he it is being recorded. So you'll be able to share it with him and uh, certainly welcome him to the team. Um, but welcome to him. he's got four people that, that have come on board uh, with Cowboys help and uh, he's, he's definitely tearing it up. So good stuff there. That is fantastic. I'm glad to hear of your success on that, Bill, and make sure you invite him in on Tuesday nights. We have a lot going on on the weekly Zooms uh, with the company and also our team Zoom, so uh, definitely plan to plug them in. Um, really excited for you. Congratulations on that. Hey, I see Deb Hull in the house. I wonder if Deb Hull would like to say hello. Deb, I'm going to ask you to unmute. Hey, there she is. Can we hear her? Voice, but that's because I'm talking a lot of glutamine. <laughs> you're losing, Zantrum you're losing your voice. Is that what you said? We missed the yeah, beginning. I always lose my voice. I think maybe I talk too much. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, never enough. We're so glad to have you. And uh, tell us what what is your first impressions? I know you've been, you know, really engaging over here on a kind of a full time basis, only for a short period of time. Maybe you can tell everybody what your first impressions are about. Uh, the company, but also about the products that you've been experiencing? Well, you know, I've been watching CTFO for about five years and getting prospected. And when I heard they were coming out with Xanthromis, I thought, oh my gosh, I was looking for something that nobody else had. And, you know, being partners with you and Kevin in the past in the Goji era, man, we know what that did. So when I heard about this, I thought, oh my gosh, I just got to give it a try. And I got in and I tried the product and 
you know, my friends and partners tried and there's no looking back. Um, you know, I have a great testimony. My mother, I've been in the industry 30 some years, three decades like you, right? We've been here forever. And, um, you know, we've had some dynamite products and testimonies on on products, but my mother, for instance, would never stay on anything. I'd buy her products, I'd go find it in the refrigerator. Well, when Xanthromist came out, I got her on the Xanthromist and she loved it. She immediately had more energy, but my mom's gonna be 83 tomorrow and she never misses a day on Xanthromist. She got taken off of one of her diabetic medicines. She doesn't have to have shots in her eyes for the macular degeneration. Um, her triglycerides came down 52 points. She no longer has high cholesterol, you know, and I guess why I'm sharing that testimony, and I'm sure there's more to it. My, you know, stepfather's got cancer. He's in the hospital. He's 75 and she's taking care of him. You know, it's just like, and that it's a lot of work. I mean, she's going through a lot. So there was the proof in the pudding. And then when the glutamus came, you know, I was very successful in an anti-aging company. And the glutamist, I just knew I couldn't stand it. And I wish I had more time to work it. But every chance I got, I'm doing a call or telling somebody about it because I know the outcome. The outcome, I mean, men, it's easy. Women, you think you don't want to prospect men? Are you kidding me? You think they don't want to look good, feel younger, live longer? And it seems like everybody knows about the glutathione. Mm. So, you know, what it is, not about our glutamus, but about glutathione. And it's been so fun. And it's so good working with you again. And Cowboy, I talk to him. I see him. We meet halfway up. He's coming from Indiana. I'm from Ohio. Him and the cowgirl, they've been friends of mine forever. And uh, it's just fun. I feel like I'm home. I'm really happy to be here. Well, welcome home. Starts, welcome, home. welcome home, Deb. We're excited that you're here and uh, glad you're getting such great results. We know this is just the beginning for you. You got so many great, great advancements in the future coming your way. And uh, we're just happy to have you a part of the team here. Um, you know, you talk a bit, a little bit about the simplicity of, of marketing glutamist and that more people know what glutathione is than say mangosteen, for instance. And, uh, and so, you know, I always tell people, look, you know, we're going to keep coming out with these incredible formulations. And Xanthomist was uh, something we came out with a little over a year ago, and it attracted a lot of leaders to our company. You're one of them um, because of the power of mangosteen, but not as wide an audience as glutathione. I was just out to dinner um, uh, about an hour and a half ago and sat next to this really nice couple at the bar and we started chit-chatting about all kinds of things and eventually it comes around to, well, what do you do? And, uh, you know, I told them a little about this product that we just launched, a uh, glutathione product, and they were mesmerized, okay? I mean, it is just the easiest thing to talk about because, uh, look, who, do, who, who doesn't want to stay young longer, right? And, uh, or reverse aging. And so, um, it's just a fun, fun product to market. And, uh, and you know, it, it's just, you, you just got to get out there and get out of your own way and, and talk to some people. Um, and get that founder's pin. And get that founder's pin. want to be a founder. I that mean, has been on, extended, guys. right? Deb, that's been extended. Yes, so March 2nd. Or, I mean, March 2nd. Uh, April 2nd. April, Here it April is, 2nd. March 2nd. You have one chance. Eight. One shot. April 2nd. Oh, you said April 2nd. I'm sorry. April 2nd. Yeah, I'm right? sorry. Yeah, so April 2nd, you have one shot at becoming a glutamous founder, right? You're going to get a nice pin for that. And there's only one chance to be a founder. This is it. It ends April 2nd. You need to bring in five people, five new people. Uh, you need to bring in, I believe the date in the past um, was, it was when this contest began. Uh, if somebody has that in front of them. It would have already been over, but I was one of those people. Oh, no, no, but it started, it started like, here's when it started. It started like February... 27? I think it was the 8th. 8th, 8th that's it. April 2nd, my memory serves me. Anyway, so, but what will happen is if you can get five people in that period of time that order at least a two-pack or a four-pack of, of Xanthomist or Glutamist or Xanthomist, Glutamist combo, right? We're not even being that specific. If you can get five new people to do at least a two-pack, you will be a founder 
forever known as and you know be able to wear that pin proudly there's only one shot at it so take advantage of that now get those people in it's really and easy. adam all they got to do is play your video from last week <laughs> and call you and then i see al diaz on here and cowboy i mean look at some of these leaders on here you That's know it's crazy. it's so don't be afraid i think that some people get fearful maybe they failed in the past in another business but guys, we got the cream of the crop with you guys. It, thank you. We appreciate that. But, it, you know, it is the product that makes such a difference, makes it easy to talk about. You know, uh, in the past, you know, you, people ask you, what do you do? And, and you got to make up something uh, that uh, is impressive. And, and maybe the product is, is something that's good, but it doesn't have a wide audience like anti-aging, like reversing aging, like the glutamus does. Al Diaz, uh, wanted to chat with you for a sec. Thanks, Deb. Appreciate you. Um, Al, I wanted to talk a little bit about, um, uh, you know, reaching out to people on social media. And you're somebody that does it better than just about anybody I know. You're very consistent about it. You schedule it. Um, you, you know, do you, I have a couple of questions quick. Do you do it and say, um, by the way, before I start, congratulations, 15K, Al Diaz, crushing it right now. Congratulations, buddy. Thank you, Ben. <laughs> um, it's not me. It's not me. It's my team. my team. It's obviously your team, right? But you know, yeah. you, you uh, you're responsible for bringing in enough people to have a team, yeah. right? <laughs> um, when you're doing your posts, you schedule those. Do you use say uh, the you know the Facebook you know Meta Business Suite to do that, or how do you how do you schedule your posts? Because you're very consistent about it. I wake up every morning and do it. Because if I schedule it, only schedule it onto your business page or your fan page. Mm -hmm. On your personal page, you have to do it personally. It does. There's no way of fixing it on your personal page. So, okay. When I wake up in the morning, I meditate, and then my next thing is to post. Now, mm -hmm. if people notice, mm -hmm. I missed two days this week or last week, right? I missed really? two days. Two days. Yeah, I did. Two days. <laughs> I was in a hospital. <laughs> okay, all right. Well, I'm just say, what happened? I hope you're okay. Yeah, uh, it was pretty bad. But hey, I'm, I'm all right. I'm here. I'm here. Okay, good. Uh, yeah, I missed two days and it was, it was tough. Um, you know, but uh, yeah, I, I wake up every morning and I do the post. Now, what I do, I have all my pictures or all my things already set for two weeks. The only thing is, I just have to post it. Um, on you my accumulate list. those, you accumulate those. Images, yeah, I, I have them. Uh, and curate those, and, yeah, and yeah. I have, I have a lot. Get those, so that you get those from some of the Facebook posts that other people are doing. Yeah, I I, I get them from from other people. Yeah, and I, and I back it up on my drive. They're all in here. Gotcha. Okay. Right? So so I have I I get them from different places, different websites. Uh, I I look for specific. Um, you know, I, I do one is motivation and one is wisdom. The wisdom mm -hmm. is always a, a scripture. Yeah. So I go through different scriptures in the Bible and look for different articles and different things and pictures that I like. Yeah. And that's what I post. But I, those I do set them all because I have to set, if you look at all my pictures, you'll see aldiasjr.com and all of them. Yeah. I have to, I do it in there because what I do that, the reason why I do that is because if somebody shares it, right, yeah. onto their wall, sure. they'll see, oh, who's Aldia Jr.? So they'll go there and, and see the page, right? So. Gotcha. That's where I do it. And so mostly you're doing that through Instagram, but it's also carries over to Facebook, correct? No, I do it the other way around. Okay, I you do it on Facebook. I do a Facebook there. and automatically goes to Instagram. All right, correct. perfect. So so uh, but it's very consistent and um mm. and then you and then people comment on them. And by the way, you you brought up something that was key. Your two focuses was wisdom and motivation. Those are the two different topics, let's call it, right? right. So People that are excited about a daily motivation are going to like your stuff. They're going to mm -hmm. follow you. People that are more into scripture and more religious nature, they're going to follow you for that reason. Mm -hmm. right? And mm -hmm. those are things that you're passionate about and that you have interest in. Mm -hmm. And uh, and so it's always important to find that thing that is maybe it's not business directly related um, that you're passionate about and that you post uh, and you hashtag about right it's important mm -hmm. that you find your lane so to speak of the things that are that are really exciting to you maybe it's hiking maybe you're into hiking and that's your thing maybe it's cooking 
Uh, for me, it could be keto. It could be any number of things, right? That mm -hmm. I'm passionate about travel, right? Maybe I'm focused on that. And as you are having people interact with you um, or comment, you're then direct messaging those people and you're, you're friending those people and you're um, you know, trying to build a relationship or collect friends. Is that kind of accurate? Yeah. Even if they just put a like or a thumbs up, Mm -hmm. I message them saying, hey, thank you for liking my post today. Right? I do that to everything. Now, the, uh, I do that to people that who have first time ever liked my posts or anything. But I don't know them. Sure. I, I always send it to them. I always send them a, a private message. I say, hey, thank you for liking my post today. And they reply and then communication. We just start talking. And it's and it's a discipline because let's face it, we all get likes. We all get thumbs ups. Mm -hmm. We all get right. And we just kind of scrolled through them like, hey, no big deal. Meanwhile, somebody took a, a, a split second out of their day to acknowledge that you existed and what you did made their day or that they enjoyed. And, mm -hmm. you know, you, you let that, that, you know, opportunity go by and it's yeah. gone, right? So you want to make sure that you reach out to everybody that interacts with you. I also do what I also do to every single day, everybody's birthday, I said, I'm happy birthday. Not on their wall. You message the directly. wall. I direct message to them. That's right. Privately. Yep. Right to them. Right. I do that every day. Every day. Every day. Now another thing that you do also, and 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 correct me if I'm wrong on this, but you're also, you know, you're you're part of different groups, right? You're you mm -hmm. groups that you have interest in, and maybe again, they might not be business related, right? You join right. one of those MLM groups. Guess what? All those people are trying to do. They're just right. trying to pitch you on the deal, yeah, right? right? And, and I just joined one today. Somebody sent me a link. It says, uh, Cubans of Miami. <laughs> I went on there and I said, oh my gosh, man. Yeah, so, you know, like, Cuban, it, 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 was, it was from Miami, right? I think, right. They, they, That's right very specific. Group. Hey, is that Gary Columbus? <laughs> Gary, is that you? <laughs> oh, Gary Columbus. <laughs> Well, see, that's, uh, <laughs> but that's very specific, right? And that works. Uh, uh, yeah, but uh, yeah, somebody invited me to one of their groups. And, and when people invite me, I, I go in there. Sure. I look, you know, I become part of it. And, and if I see that's worth being part of the group, I yeah. say, if it's not, I just leave. You know, no right. if there's people. a value being shared, if there's, yeah, things exactly. that are, you know, that it will keep you interested in, in that. Right. So, but then what you do is you uh, like people's posts, you comment on their posts, you then friend uh, some of those people, and then eventually mm -hmm. you send a message. It's called the, the CLAM formula, right? Yeah, Comment, yeah. like, add, right? Add a friend, mm -hmm. and then mm -hmm. eventually you message them. And you don't do it maybe right away, but you also don't take forever either, because you're trying to go through the numbers when right. it comes to cold market. Right? And, and, and trust me, they're, they're going to come back at you. If, if they're network marketers, they're going to they're gonna approach. I don't approach them at all. Of yeah. business at all. I just strictly talk about friendship and all. Yeah. They approached me in the last two months. Ninety nine percent of the people who approached me are about Bitcoin platforms and Bitcoin this and Bitcoin that right. because Bitcoin is going out of the roof. Yeah, you know? right. And, so they come I out just, of the woodwork. Those yeah. people. So yeah. I, I I just go along with them. I don't say nothing what yeah. I'm doing. I told them I am involved with Bitcoin. I buy my own Bitcoins. I buy my own things, mm -hmm. but I'm not involved in any platform. So we, yeah. I continue the relationship because if I say no to them right off the bat, that ends the relationship. So I won't talk to them anymore. That's so right. I just say, oh, yeah, well, I'm, I'm part of Bitcoin. I, you know, my son part of it in the yeah, industry yeah. and yeah, so on. Sure. So, yeah. So. Fantastic. It, it, and yeah, those people will pop out of the woodwork. One oh of, yeah, they will. One, one, of, one of the things that you realize, if you look at the history of that, uh, not to just take a sidebar here, but is that um, the the actual currency, uh, you know, cryptocurrency, not a terrible mm -hmm. thing, but when you try to layer a compensation plan on that, yeah. uh, bad things happen. Bad things. <laughs> Very bad things happen. There has not and, been one, there has not been one that still <laughs> exists from back then. <laughs> there you go. And not only, not only do bad things happen when you layer a network marketing compensation plan on them, but even if you don't, no. You know, there are bad things that happen yeah, you, you in, lose that, money. in it, that industry. It, it, it's, a thing. it's a thing. It's a kind of money. money. So, yeah, and uh, the ones who make money, don't get me wrong, there's a lot of people who make money. Yeah. Uh, the ones who get in first and yeah. recruit. And then right. after that, it's they all go right. to the next one. That's because right. they know it's going to bottom out. They're not going to bottom out. <laughs> Absolutely. No question. Well, listen, I, I wanted to cover that real briefly. Um, I want We're, we're kind of closing in on time here. 
But I did want to point out that, listen, you know, this business is attracting a lot of, thank you very much, Al, by the way, for piping in on that. Um, this business is attracting a lot of great leadership right now. And that's not just something we're saying, it's actually happening. There's people that are social media influencers that are hopping on board. Uh, Mike Swain did a great interview recently, and I posted that on Biz Builders. If you haven't seen that, make sure you do. Um, that are just blown away by what's happening here. Because you got to remember something. The only other way to get pharmaceutical grade uh, glutathione directly into your bloodstream, the way we're doing it, or I should say as effectively or nearly as effectively as we're doing it, is with an IV drip, right? Which is very expensive. And there's clinics all over that are doing this. Um, it, it upwards of two hundred and fifty dollars a session. You got to have like four sessions a month, and then even then, you, your levels of glutathione aren't constant. You know, all the time, right? You're not if you just get one a week, one injection a week. You know, what about the rest of the days, right? Whereas we have a solution that can keep your glutathione levels up all day long, every day, for a fraction of the cost without an injection, without a doctor's visit. So. Um, this is something that people are blown away by when they hear that contrast, right? Because people know, I mean, look, look around your town, how many IV clinics have popped up in recent months, right? They're popping up all over and it's a very viable, you know, uh, experience that people do. They, they, they do other things besides glutathione, but glutathione is a big one and it's, uh, and it's expensive when you do it that way. So we've we've got a much more affordable option for the masses, and uh, if the masses were able to afford the V drip, they'd do that too because of the power of glutathione. Um, but so a lot of great leadership coming in. Uh, what I want to remind you is that you are only in competition with your yesterday's self. Do not compare yourself to anybody else. You've not walked their road. You've not gone on their path. You might not have their experiences, maybe in business, maybe in direct sales or network marketing. You might not have that experience. And so you're probably not going to move as fast as those people. But you're, again, not in competition. It's you versus you. So don't compare yourself to anyone else. It's so important. You know, can you learn a new skill? Can you learn how to post? Can you learn how to like and comment and uh, and friend people uh, in uh, groups that have a similar interest to you? Absolutely, you can, right? You can do that. Um, and so uh, I just wanna say, take the time to work on yourself at getting better, be a better you tomorrow than you were yesterday. And, and you can have success in this business because there's a window right now. There's a window here that is a short window, right? It's a short window. There were a lot of people alive before you were born. And guess what? After you're dead, there are going to be a lot of people uh, that continue on after you're dead. So you've, you're on this planet for a short window. What are you going to do in that short window? What are you going to do in that time? How are you going to make a difference and make an impact? What kind of legacy are you going to leave for your family and, and the people that you care about? Right? How, what are they going to say about you when you're gone? You know, this is that window right now. And you've got an opportunity that's very rare with what's happening with glutamus. Take full advantage of that uh, and really, really live the kind of life that you wanna live. You have that opportunity in front of you right now. So that was my message for you guys tonight. I do want to let you know there's a Super Saturday coming up on the 30th of this month. There's gonna be some great announcements. There's gonna be a lot of great stuff on that one. Plug into it, register for, for it. Uh, there'll be links coming to you via email if you haven't seen those already uh, from the company, you'll definitely will. Super Saturday on the 30th of this month. Take advantage of that. Um, next week, we're going to have Stu Finger, the one, the only Stu Finger here on Tuesday Night Live. So you want to big build big for that. That should be exciting. Tonight at, at 9 p.m. Eastern, coming up shortly, Mike Swilling. I'm going to be doing the corporate uh, opportunity event. Should be an amazing Zoom event. If you've got prospects, put them on. Mike is one of the best at sharing this opportunity with folks. And uh, he'll be doing that tonight at 9 p.m. All right, guys, appreciate you all being here. Thank you for plugging into Tuesday Night Live. Again, we do it every Tuesday night at 8 p.m. Eastern. And uh, again, tonight, ctfowebinar.com at 9 p.m. for the corporate Zoom. Also this week, I'll make mention our friend Charlie, 
who uh, you got to meet last week. He's going to be on the Thursday night uh, product call uh, at 9 p.m. with David D'Archangelo, and he is an expert at glutathione who just joined our team. Really excited for you to meet, if you haven't already, Charlie. Uh, he's going to be fantastic on there. Anyway, thank you all for being here. We appreciate you all. Bye-bye for now. Have a good night. Good night, everyone. Have a good evening, everybody.